Phil's Creepy Vids. Hey there, horror fans. It's your buddy Phil here. And I uh, just got home from work and there was a package in the mail from uh, Daryl. He is Mr. Meat Hook. Y'all know Daryl uh, does Free the Figure Fridays. He does Taste Test Tuesdays. Really good content. Uh, does a lot of horror unboxings. He gets Fright Crate and... and uh, I don't know whether he gets Cryptocurium or not, Parcel of Terror. I think he might get Parcel of Terror every now and then, but super cool channel. Go check it out. I will leave his link in the description below. And uh, it was originally supposed to be just, uh, I, I bought him a pin that he wanted, uh, threw a couple extras in, some mystery minis, and it kind of turned into a trade box. Um, so I do know one item that is in this box. Um, I'm not going to tell you what it is yet. But, it is because Canada does not have Target, and uh, the U.S. does have Target, so this was a Target exclusive. So I'm just going to open this box and see what, uh, what Daryl sent me. And the package came in good shape, looks like no, uh, looks like they didn't use it as a soccer ball, so that's good. Really good tape job so since I know the one thing in this box uh, I am gonna go and do a blind unboxing but I am gonna try and get the one figure or the one thing from Target and I think it's right on top looks like this might be it uh, he was talking to me and he said he did forget to put a note in so I know there is no note. So yeah, super cool. Alien Covenant, uh, the Target exclusive. So it's like a book uh, with all the artwork, uh, secrets revealed in the 36 page book packaging, featuring an inside look at David's lab and the creatures of Alien Covenant plus behind the scenes photography and concept sketches. Super cool that I have this. Uh, not very many people in Canada do have this due to the fact that there are no targets in Canada. So this is the one item that I told him I really wanted and he was nice enough to go grab me a copy of it. Really sorry guys. Worked all day. Been talking all day. So looks like a little collaboration of stuff here. I'm just going to try and not spill everything all over the place like I normally do. Looks like some stickers. Oh, there might be a pin in there. And that's empty. So that's super cool. Looks like a little Gremlins uh, NECA yeah, little gremlins, NECA, you can write something on there. Super cool. That is no year on that. But yeah. You got little sad gizmo. Pretty cool. Thanks for that. And we do have a sticker of Freddy. I think this was from the sticker book from years ago. Because it's got like... 258 on the back. We put the sticker in the book where 258 is. There's a few of these. Here's, uh, you know, the punk girl from part three. Uh, always forget her name. Uh, Taryn. Taryn? I think it might be Taryn. Super cool. Ah, uh, this one I freaking love. The Fulci zombie sticker freaking love it thank you so much i actually got the uh you might have seen a while ago i got the zombie pin with the spinning worm spinning worm eye super cool love that sticker oh and it's like a vinyl sticker super good quality and we do we got a couple enamel pins here super cool we got the black and white 
from Night of the Living Dead, and we got a little Sean from Shaun of the Dead. Love both of those. They will make a welcome addition to my ever-growing pin board. Love it. Super cool. Thank you so much. And feels like there's a big item in here. Very well wrapped. And I can already see what it is. I think. Yes, awesome. So this was the Jason hockey mask that was in a Fright Crate. Uh, this came out before I had hopped on the Fright Crate train. Uh, so I mentioned to Daryl that I loved that mask, so he was nice enough to include it. I don't know whether he gave me his or had ordered it or how he got this, but freaking love it. It is going right up on the wall. Freaking love it. Exclusive to Fright Crate. Uh, if you don't know about Fright Crate, uh, www.frightcrate.net. Uh, goes on sale at the start of every month, so go order, go order Fright Crate, because you're going to miss out on cool shit like this. But, like I said earlier, everybody go sub to um, Daryl, Mr. Meat Hook, um, great content on his channel, uh, and, uh, you know, I'm going to end it like this. Stay cool, stay sexy, just like me. Peace!